Hello darlings, it's Louis here, it's the Benidorm Fanatic, and in this video, I'm going to show you Benidorm on a budget. So I'm going to show you some of the cheapest bars, the cheapest restaurants, and in general, some of the cheapest places you can go whilst you're here in Benidorm on a budget. So let's go. Everything's very nice. <laughs> Okay, so I've handpicked a bunch of restaurants and a bunch of bars as well, which I think, in my opinion, are some of the best good value and good to eat and drink in restaurants. Now, I'm on Levante Beach at the moment. Now, there's not a lot of really cheap places on Levante Beach. So if you are here on a budget, I would avoid eating and drinking on the beachfront unless you go to somewhere like Aromas, uh, the British Cafe, which just does a good cheap breakfast. But failing that, I've got a few great restaurants and a few great bars to take you. <laughs> okay, so I've just come onto the strip, and the first place I'm going to take you is the Yorkshire Pride, which is a great British party restaurant, which is just over the road here. But just behind me, we've got Jumpin' Jacks, which is one of the cheaper bars along this route to get a nice few shots, a nice cold beer, and it's got a great terrace as well. But all these bars, just before you get to the main part of the strip, are very cheap and very reasonable, and great places to drink as well. But here we are at Yorkshire Pride, one of my favourite good British restaurants that's been here for many years and has got a great reputation as well. Very, very busy in the Yorkshire Prize as well. It can get very busy, and so it is. We're coming early to get a table here, but you do get large plates full of very, very good quality British food, and the menu is very varied and very big as well. Let's take a look. I'll show you that menu here. Look, there we are. So you've got your full English breakfast. They even do the um the greedy man's breakfast, the breakfast challenges as well here. But you can get Sunday dinner, but not only on a Sunday, you can get roast dinners every single day. Snacks, burgers, main courses. You know, you've got your pub classics as well, pub classics on there, and kids' meals. It's very, very good, very cheap, and you'll leave here very satisfied, I promise. Let's go, on. And then we've got Andy's here as well, which is another another great cheap bar. Like I said, all the bars here are really cheap and really reasonable. What I like about Andy's is they do really, really nice shots. I got uh, watermelon tequila, tequila rosé um, on, on one of my last videos. And the drinks are really good. Are really, really good. And not cheap, not expensive at all. Not expensive at all. When you can think about the other end of the strip, where the entertainment is, it can start to get quite expensive. <laughs> okay, so if you do find yourself on Benidorm Square, on the main part of the strip here, the British Square, one of the cheapest places to actually drink here will be the railway, where they offer cocktails for like two for six euro, two for six, seven euros, and the vibe in here is really great. It's just opened not long ago, and it's a brilliant, brilliant place for cheap drinks, good entertainment, and yeah, good vibes. Let's that. have a look. Like, have a look, have a look. look. Now it's worth pointing out as well, if you don't want to go to a restaurant or you just want a little snack, if you're out on the piss, you're having a few drinks and you want a kebab, a KFC, a McDonald's, there's loads of them in Benidorm fast food restaurant. Just even got KFC on the main strip. We've got another one down there. We've got a McDonald's on the beach front. We've got loads of kebab houses. Uh, we've got Mr. Chips. There's loads of places. Now, that's one thing about Benidorm is there's lots of places to eat and drink. Now, the ones I've picked are just a few of many out there, but these are the ones I really, really like. But it is worth pointing out, there's lots of variety here. Isn't it? Well, I couldn't possibly do this video without mentioning Uncle Ped's, which is certainly 
one of the cheapest bars here in Benidorm. You've got your one euro shots, you've got your one euro beers as well, and all the drinks and they do big cocktails for a tenner as well, big jug cocktails, and very nice drinks as well. But the good thing about Uncle Ped's is the fact that they've got great from the fabulous Pablo Bloom, which is a guy I love. Yeah, orange beans. Just let's have a little look at some of the cheap, cheap offers that they've got. Hello, babe. How are you? I've got happy bar staff as well. Fabulous bar. Look how pretty this bar lady is. She gorgeous. She gorgeous. Colada. Drugs are set on the beach. Got pina coladas, white flushing. Everything for a tenner. You know what? You can get this there. Three projects. And I've also started doing food as well. get really good bucket deals here as well. It's very popular for groups here. So for 5 50 you can get a bucket of, of Amstel or for 7 50 a bucket of salt guys if you have enjoyed this video please do not go, forget to go ahead and subscribe as well you can also find me on tiktok and facebook as well at the benedol fanatic or you can find me on instagram but yes go ahead and subscribe for more videos coming up and hit that notification bell as well hit that notification bell Right, so now I can't just talk about British bars. We have to throw the odd Spanish bar in there as well. Now here behind me, we have got Mariano's famous for its chicken and chips, curry and chips, kebabs, everything. And it's open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Now this is the quietest I've actually seen it for a while. It's normally very, very busy, especially at five or six o'clock in the morning when you're face the chicken and chips after a few drinks on the strip. But Mariano is great and it's very popular with the Spanish and that's how you know a restaurant is actually quite good here when you know the locals go there. But what a great place. Okay, so the final British restaurant I am going to take you is Sonderbar, which is excellent value for money, good quality homemade food, and really, really is cheap as chips. It's one of my favourite restaurants out there all the time. But as we go up to Sonder, you've also got Uncle Ron's, which is famous for its one euro pint, and a very good pint indeed as well as a one euro glass of wine. No, you can't beat that for value for money. It's very popular here in Benidorm. But let's take a look at Sonder, shall we? Okay, so here we are at Sonder Bar. Now, as I said, that is my favorite place. It's got a great big terrace for the summer as well. And it's right up the Calalondra, up the hill, down from the bottom of KFC. Here. But let's go take a little look inside. Now, it is that time of the night where it's a bit quiet. People have been out all day drinking and it will get a bit busier again later on in the evening. But let's go and take a look at the menu. In fact, one thing I do like about Sonderbar is the Parmo chicken here. Now, the Bulldogs do a great Parmo chicken, but the one here is absolutely fantastic. I love it. And €9.50 and you get a plate full of food like that. And as you can tell, a larger queen such as myself does like a big plate of food. Let's take a look at the menu. But they also do, um, they had also got a little bit of a Spanish influence and then they do a little bit of tapas share and boards. You've got your bread and aioli, garlic mushrooms. Uh, they do do a roast dinner here as well, three courses for a tenner on a Sunday. And you've got your like your liver and bacon, hunter's chicken. But like I said, one of my favourite things with tapas there. One of my favourite things about Sunday is the Parmo chicken, I love it. And they do a hot and spicy one as well, which is brilliant. So there we are, Sunday 
Look who we've got here as well in Sons. We've got the famous Chrissy Rock, one of Ben Adonis' fans. Enjoy the lovely roast dinners. Well, what do you think of the food here? Lovely. It's lovely. Yeah. Great, completely can't beat it. And you've got lovely Jackie. Jackie and here as well. Pink and Dark Willow. Oh. She does pie and mash. Oh, you yeah, pie and mash? Oh, I love a good pie and mash as well. Can't beat it, can you? Can't beat a pie and mash, especially in Benetton. Great, Sunday's here. Yeah. You get three courses for a tennis. Oh, no, yeah. Three courses for a tennis. Very nice. <laughs> Very nice, there we are. If you don't take it from me, take it from Chrissy Rock herself. And Jackie. And Jackie. And what's your name, son? Peter and Peter, there we are. Hot shot Palmer, which is looks enormous. Absolutely enormous. Okay, so I think since about time I mixed it up a little bit more and showed you one of my favourite Indian slash Nepalese restaurants as well. Now, I'm not saying it's the best. All of the Indian restaurants are here are good, but this is certainly one of the cheapest. And in their set menu, you get rice, uh, garlic, garlic naan as well included together, which some of the other Indian restaurants it's don't do. Gorgeous. It is, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. Let's get in there and take a look, and I'll have a little oh look gosh, at their menu as well. Can I go with you? You can go with me <laughs> anywhere you want, fella. So there's the set menu, so you get the start set, main course, and you can also have anything off the main course menu as well, so they give you a variety of choices, and here it is delicious. My favourite thing here is the uh, chicken karai, the chicken tikka karai, why? Because it's a Nepalese dish, it's something a little bit different, a little bit of sweetness in there, as well as a little bit of spice, I love it. <laughs> so this is the menu, so the starters, you get a mixed starter on your bars, use chicken pakora, chicken tikka, and there's loads of different dishes here. Too many to show in, in one video, but loads. And there's lots of vegetarian dishes as well. I'm going to leave them through because they're very busy. Thank you. So I've just met lovely Olivia here in the, in the restaurant. What did you think of food? It was lovely. Really? I'd recommend it to people if you ask me where to go. It's definitely a good value for money. Brilliant. But I have noticed you're drinking water in Benidorm, which is terrible. Oh, you've got wine, are you forgiving that? Are oh, you forgiving? Well, lovely to meet you, Olivia. Thank you very much. Right, so next, the final place I'm going to take you is to China Garden. Now, China Garden here in Benidorm has been re renowned for being one of the best Chinese restaurants. Now, I disagree. I wouldn't say it's the best. I'd say it's very good value for money. And I'm actually eating in there tonight. So you'll actually see us eating in the restaurant. And it's very good. And I'll show you firsthand how good the food is. It's not the best. If it was up to me, I'd go to Home Sushi or I'd go to Bamboo. But if you're paying three courses for a tenner with a glass of wine, a beer or a soft drink, you can't beat that for value for money. It's certainly worth that. Anyway, let's go and check it out. Well, I am starving. After all that walk around, it's time I had a good hearty meal in the China Garden. So we've just been greeted by the lovely staff and we've got a table for us here. Uh, we've, just, we've got a set menu which used to be 9 euros, it's now 10 euros, but still great. Yeah, so we one of us has ordered noodles, one of us has ordered rice, and uh, so you get three courses for 10 euros, don't you? So I've ordered the soup, you've ordered a spring roll. Spring roll. There we go. Oh, I, don't know. Oh, you I don't know what I can't remember what I ordered. That's the only vegetarian Yeah, it's not really good for vegetarian options, is it really? The set menu anyway. I wouldn't look really in the restaurant. But I'm being sensible, we're drinking Fanta Lemons today, so we're not having Benadol shots or or, 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 or uh, not, not yet exactly. So we'll look forward to seeing what it's like. We've got the lovely ladies and gentlemen next to me have ordered this set meal. And it looks very good indeed, it looks very nice. Right, so the main courses have arrived and they look quite good for a tenner omelette there because of the veggie and we've got beef and chocolate so we have got a, the chicken curry, beef sizzler here, beef sizzler. And I've got chicken balloons. Is this yours, mate? So, the good thing is they give you a nice shot at the end. 
I think so. What is it, Ian? I don't know. Well, it's better to be drunk petrol before now. 14%. Well, there we are. That was the China Garden at Benidorm. And you know what? For value for money for a tenner, you can't go wrong. Like I said, it's not the greatest, not the best, but it fills you up. And for a tenner, you can't go wrong. But that's not the only restaurant here in Benidorm. There are many other fabulous, fabulous places to try. But I hope this video has been very informative for you on the budget end of restaurants and places to drink here in Benidorm but thank you for watching and don't forget to hit that notification bell if you have enjoyed this, this video leave a comment if you've been to Benidorm or any of these fabulous places leave us a comment and let us know what you thought you can also find me on TikTok as well at the Benidorm Fanatic I do do daily lives and you can also find me on Instagram and Facebook as well at the Benidorm Fanatic but like I always say if you can be anything in this life be fabulous and thank you very much for watching thank you.